Good evening. I would like to call a May 8, 2017 Belbrook City Council meeting to order. Would everyone please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Roll call. Mr. Edwards? Here. Mr. Greenwood? Here. Mr. McGill? Here. Mrs. Middlestetter? Here. Mrs. Seeger Lawson? Here. Mr. Schweller? Here. Mayor Baird? Here. Formal approval of the City Council regular meeting minutes of April 24th, 2017. Does any member on council have any corrections or additions to the regular City Council meeting minutes of our last meeting? I had none, Mayor. None, none, Mayor. Seeing none, the minutes are approved as written. Mayor's announcements? Um, I, I just have one. I guess I could have waited till the end. A longtime resident, uh, Donnie White, passed away this morning. Donnie, as I think most of the people who grew up in Bellbrook, um, was sort of a fixture in the city of Bellbrook. He was developmentally challenged, is probably a good way to put it, and people knew Donnie. He was most definitely a fixture. I'd like to send my condolences to the White family, Mrs. White and his mom, who's still living. Donnie, I think, moved, and his mom moved to Xenia four or five years ago. Donnie was probably in his middle 60s, and I think uh, if you went to high school with him or grew up in this town, you definitely know Donnie White. So I'd like to send the condolences to uh, Mrs. White and his family. And that is all I have. Uh, public hearing and ordinances, none. Introduction of ordinances, none. We have one resolution this evening, resolution 2017-N. Mr. McGill. Thank you, Mayor. Uh, resolution number 2017-N, a resolution authorizing the city manager to sign an agreement with Patricia N. Campbell, LLC, to serve as municipal attorney. Whereas the section 7.09 of the Bellbrook City Charter requires the appointment of the municipal attorney, and whereas Patricia N. Campbell is an attorney at law admitted to the practice of law in the state of Ohio and is in good professional standing, and whereas Patricia Campbell has an office located in the city of Bellbrook, and whereas the city's current agreement with Patricia and Campbell will expire on June 30, 2017. Now, therefore, the city of Bellbrook hereby resolves section one, that the city manager is here, excuse me, that the city manager is hereby authorized to sign the attached agreement with Pat the Patricia and Campbell LLC to serve as municipal attorney, effective July 1, 2017, through June 30, 2019. Section 2, that this resolution shall take effect and be enforced forthwith. Yes, uh, thank you. Uh, Ms. Campbell has been the municipal attorney now for three years, uh, or coming up on three years. Uh, we've been very satisfied with the service she provides. Uh, she's literally right down the street, so if we need something, uh, we can uh, go to her. Uh, it's nice to be able to support a uh, Bellbrook business uh, uh, with the services. At times, if we have something very specialized, uh, union negotiations or personnel matters, we'll, we'll contract with another attorney, but she handles a lot of our day-to-day uh, -day activities. Uh, so uh, we would uh, recommend uh, uh, retaining her as municipal attorney for at least two more years. Uh, she did not uh, ask for an increase in her rate, so her rate will remain the same uh, that it has been for the previous contracts. Mm -hmm. Any questions for our city manager? Seeing none, may I have a motion to adopt resolution 2017-N? So moved. May I have a second? Second. Roll call. Forced. Okay. Motion by Mr. McGill to adopt resolution 2017-N, a resolution authorizing the city manager to sign an agreement with Patricia N. Campbell, LLC, to serve as municipal attorney. Seconded by Mr. Greenwood. Mr. McGill? Yes. Mr. Greenwood? <coughs> yes. Mr. Edwards? Yes. Mrs. Middlestetter? Yes. Mrs. Seeger Lawson? Yes. Mr. Schweller? Yes. Mayor Baird? Yes. Moving on, city manager's report. Uh, yes, just uh, one item this evening. I just wanted to thank the voters for approving our general fund renewal levy uh, last Tuesday. 83% uh, of the voters approved that. There were only 414 voting, but uh, it's always nice to have a number uh, higher than 80% uh, approving a uh, renewal levy that doesn't increase your taxes. So uh, just appreciate that, and uh, we'll continue moving forward and uh, doing the providing the service that we always have. Any questions for our city manager this evening? None, 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 none. We'll move on to uh, committee report service. 
no service report. Safety? Uh, no safety report. Finance and audit. We got money, Mike. Mayor, just just to report, just like what city manager said, I'm very thankful that the levy passed, and I think that shows that our, our citizens have a lot of faith that we're spending the money wisely, which we contend to do. And I think it's just a a, a nice vote of confidence that we had an 83 percent favorable vote for the uh, uh, levy. Anyone else? I agree, Mike. Thank you. Moving on, community affairs. Uh, just that we are, will be interviewing uh, the applicants for the position on the Old Village Review Board in the next week or so, as um, soon as we get those scheduled. And um, to my knowledge, that's the only board that has a vacancy. Wonderful. Unless somebody hasn't said anything yet. <laughs> All right, don't, don't jinx us. Don't jinx it, last no. time we said that. No, <laughs> that's true. That's true. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Take that back. Okay. Um, anything else with community affairs and none um, old business do we have any old business this evening new business any new business I'm not gonna jink us we're probably on a record pace here <laughs> <laughs> uh, open discussion Nick I don't have anything tonight mayor Forrest uh, nothing mayor. nothing mayor I don't have anything either. Uh, I am sorry. It slows down a little bit. No, take your time. Um, We're not in a rush. I just, I just wanted to report that I did go to the Green County Regional Planning meeting, <clears throat> meeting that was on April 25th, and um, there was discussion there about the 2020 census starting. Um, so I know it's early to be thinking about 2020, but um, uh, the lady who was speaking uh, from the Census Bureau said that, it, that they got a lot of flack in 1990 that they didn't count the right number of people. Um, and because that has to do with all the funding of um, state governments and I guess local governments as well, um, they wanted to make sure they counted everybody. So they're starting early, There's gonna, they're going to start sending out information, they're going to do training sessions with um, cities and villages and um, uh, uh, counties uh, to try and make sure that they have recorded all the valid um, addresses so that they know who to send the censuses to. Um, they also said that um, one in every six people gets a long form and so what she said is that when that happened last time people that got the long form kind of checked in with their neighbors and friends and said hey did you get one like this and they all said no so they didn't fill it out they thought it was maybe a scam or maybe you know uh -huh. maybe not legitimate so she wanted everyone to know that yes if you do get a long form it is possible you're one of every six that got a long form and they would like to have the information if you get it um, so we're going to be hearing more and more about the census coming up um, mm -hmm. but I just want to start that conversation Thank you very much. That's it. Mr. Schwell. Nothing for this evening, Mayor. And I have nothing other than once again thanking the voters, like Mr. Schlagheck and Mr. Schweller already did. Um, so it is open to the audience this evening, our one lovely guest this evening. And if you have any comments, you can come up five minutes and say your name and address. No. Okay, Louis. I, no. Seeing none. Okay. <laughs> Um, seeing none, does any other member on council have anything to come before us this evening at this night's city council meeting? I do not. No, no, no. Seeing none, this meeting is adjourned.